Hello you guys, welcome back to the vlog. Today is Wednesday, November the 18th, I believe. <laughs> um, I think it is. It's going so fast, this month is flying by. But my name is Erica, if you're new here, if you're not new here, thank you so much again for clicking on this video. I love you guys. It's actually really cold today. Finally starting to feel a little bit like Christmas season to me. It's been um, like in the 60s and 70s, but yesterday we had like this super blustery day the cold front came through and it's gonna be in the 50s the next couple of, actually the high today is supposed to be 50 so if it makes it that high but yeah and that's pretty cold for right now especially when we're just you know not acclimated to it so um i don't have it's actually afternoon i kind of had a change of plans today but i still decided to vlog i jackson was supposed to be getting baptized at church tonight which is a huge deal but it's actually moved to January, so he's not going to get, um, I mean, he could get baptized on a Sunday morning, any Sunday morning, but I think we're going to wait until January to do it with his, um, he does it in youth group. They're doing, they do it once a semester, so he is not going to do it this time. He's going to do it in January, so I'm still going to vlog, though. Uh, today's going to be just an average day. I am going to go run some errands and pick up Jackson, take him to get a haircut, those kinds of things, you know, tonight I'm just gonna, he's gonna go to youth group with Marion and I'm gonna be making dinner and it is a recipe that I've shared before but I'm doing a little different so um, yeah, you'll have to stay tuned and see what I, well you probably will already see by the thumbnail, I don't know, <laughs> but it's something I saw on Pinterest and I'm just using my recipe and you know, with a little twist. So I always like to add recipes into my vlogs. I just think, think that it makes it, uh, you know, more interesting than just an average daily vlog. If you add in a new recipe or, you know, add in a lot of cleaning motivation or some organizing or some shopping, I try to like mix it up. So that's what I've been doing lately. Seems like when I have a meal that's going to be more, um, I don't know, something I want to share, I'll put it into a vlog. So with that said, I need to get moving because it, like I said, it's afternoon and um, I'm going to share with you where I'm going when I get there. It's um, something I like to do often. Um, also, I got a haircut in case you noticed. Uh, Madison last week gave me a haircut. She cut about three to four inches off. It was really needing it. It was getting long, but you see how like it looks much thicker. You know, I have super, super fine hair, but it looks so much thicker when it's cut. And then she did like um. I forget what you call it. <laughs> she you knows she did the foils and uh, filled in and then she toned it and she's gotten so good at it. Like she knows exactly what I'm looking for. And this was the best I think that she's done. She's finally like perfected the formula for my hair. So it does look different. It's definitely like a more, I, I like her to take out the orange and she adds like blues. And anyways, I did get a haircut and I love it. up here on Liberty Mountain which is um, Liberty University is down there I showed you the um, view from the top up here I love there's this little spot in this one parking lot is my favorite spot it's shaded by these trees because this afternoon Sun is right here I like to come down here and um, in, until I get Jackson from school so I, I like to give myself a half hour to an hour and I just come up here and have my quiet time as I'm like overlooking the city and I you know pray worship read my Bible I have the Bible app on my phone and uh, I just find it really I don't know rich this having a time set aside every day to you know spend time with the Lord reading the Bible like I said praying worshiping and um, so for there's many like instances in the Bible when people went up into the mountains to pray and I know that you can do it anywhere like it doesn't matter but it just feels rich when I come up here I don't know I don't know it's something that I wanted to do for years and I finally started doing it and I really enjoy it it's like when you're sitting in front of the ocean and you just kind of feel like the massiveness of God you know just like how big he is and yeah I don't know I've just always been that way so I can see the beautiful Blue Ridge Mountains I can overlook my city so I can pray for the city and 
it's just quiet up here. It's quiet, I'm alone, and that's hard for me to get quiet alone time, so this is my time, so that's what I do. I don't even know that my fam family even knows that I do this, but <laughs> I enjoy it. It's something that I've started doing and really, really like, so I'm just gonna do that. It's like 2.15, so I'll have like 45 minutes before I have to leave and go get Jackson, so I'm gonna enjoy that, and I will, give you a shot of the Blue Ridge Mountains because they are gorgeous today. It's beautiful. It's a little hazy, but it's sunny and windy and cold. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and just spend some time with the Lord and then I will catch back up with you when I get Jackson. So I got Jackson. Say hey. <laughs> He's asking Siri something very important. Um, turn off that. Don't want to get copyrighted. We are in the McDonald's drive-thru. I'm getting him a snack. And then we're actually going to go pick up my niece and my nephew because they just flew in yesterday from the Bahamas. They're here for Thanksgiving and then they're leaving and coming back for Christmas. But um, Madison's doing like my sister's hair and then... I don't know if I told y'all, but I know I posted on Instagram. Madison has a job. She rented a booth at a salon, so she's actually doing hair. This one she did my hair, and she's doing hair and nails, and she's doing amazing, but she's doing my sister's hair. She's been doing it for like four or five hours today, and then I'm going to bring Jackson to get a haircut, and my niece, Ella, is going to get a haircut or get her hair done, and I'm going to pick up my nephew, too, and I think he's going to go to youth group tonight with Jackson. He was going to go watch him get baptized, but like I said, that's going to be in January now, but it's going to be a busy evening, busy afternoon, and then when he goes to youth group, then I'll be home. Um, I don't know. I don't know what the plan is. I plan on making dinner, but we'll just have to see. Jackson got his hair cut. He looks so handsome, but he does not like being on camera that much. So I got what I could. I got the footage that I could. But Jackson and Rocco are playing chess. Rocco is apparently a chess legend. Chess legend. <laughs> yeah. Where's that So how many times did y'all play in the car and you won? A lot. <laughs> Jackson's Dude, really I'm good. I'm so at, confused right now. Like, so, like, he's really good at chess, but when he can, comes up against Rocco, you can hardly see. So and this know. one won't be quiet. Okay. You gotta bark at Rocco. You gotta bark at Rocco, huh? You just gotta say hi. Yeah, you so sweet. You don't never bark, do you? You're so cute. <laughs> Jackson, though, you're learning good skills, though, you know? Don't. Checkmate. No, check. How is that a mate? It's check. I know. Going to the left. All right, I ran the boys to youth group. Marion's up there directing traffic, so I have the house to myself. It's quiet. This very rarely happens that I have nobody home. But I do enjoy it when it happens. I love my family, but I also like to have some peace and quiet. Of course, the dogs are like bugging me to give them their balls. They want to play with their balls, so it's always something going on. But I'm about to make dinner. Before I left to take them, I went ahead and browned up my chicken. So I've just got some chicken tenderloins, and I just cooked those in some olive oil and put some body of seasoning on them. And I'm going to make... I'm going to show you, like, you can take a screenshot of the chicken pot pie recipe. I also have a video on it, so I'll link that in the description box. Um, so I'm not going to, um, you know, put all the measurements in this one, but it's super easy. And I've been using this, I don't know how many years. It was a cookbook that my girls, when they were in elementary school, the school did a fundraiser and we all sent in recipes. And this is in that one, and it is so good. Of course, you use pie crust. You use the uh, refrigerated pie crust that you roll out. But I'm going to be using, I'm just going to omit the pie crust and just pour the filling into a dish and then put tater tots on top. 
and then just bake them bake it until they are you know fully cooked so super easy right chicken top pie I think it's a fun um, play on chicken pot pie so I'll show you the recipe and then I'm just gonna start putting everything together and then pop it in the oven and then I think I'm actually gonna go downstairs and work on my craft room that video before this one you would have seen the first video I'm gonna go down and do some painting and it's coming along and I'm excited so this is the recipe sorry for the shadows this is the um, ingredients and then it's also up here and then here's your recipe the directions really simple and so 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 good I think the heavy cream is what makes it so good That looks so good and I am so hungry <laughs> like usual while well, it is almost 8 o'clock 745 so definitely late for dinner for me but I'm gonna actually have to let it cool because it's too soupy you know it'll just it needs to thicken up a little bit I went ahead and made Jackson some rice aroni with ground chicken he loves his rice aroni and I told him I would have that ready for him when he gets home from church even though they feed them at church but you know he's a 12 year old boy he likes to eat so anyway i have just been enjoying this quiet like sitting in my recliner and the house is quiet and it's been wonderful <laughs> so i'm gonna let that cool i'm gonna sit down i'm watching a few youtube videos just catching up on some stuff after i eat also i'm gonna clean the kitchen madison is still actually working she's still working on my niece she's probably gonna be there for another hour and a half or so so late night for her she started about 10 o'clock this morning and she won't get done till like after nine. So almost 12 hours of work, but she's doing what she loves, so that's good. Oh, that looks so good. So hot and steamy perfect for this freezing cold night so I am gonna head downstairs now these are our freshly carpeted stairs Marion put the new carpet on yesterday and it looks so good and you'll see this in my basement craft room video but right now the floor is a disaster because we pulled up the old carpet we're gonna lay this carpet but right now I'm gonna paint all of this um, the railings and all this down here around both sides of the stairs I'm gonna paint that white and also I'm gonna paint that part of the wall that's pink <laughs> that's gonna be painted white so this is gonna be also in my like I said my craft room video so I'm not gonna film uh, in this vlog but I am gonna film it for that video so I'm gonna start um, doing that now and then once that dries probably tomorrow we'll be able to put the carpet in and then we'll be able to like you know bring everything together so the boys are kind of being loud upstairs they got back from church and they're playing chess again so <laughs> that's their favorite thing to do right now anyways after i do this i'm gonna go 
clean the kitchen and then I'm probably gonna close out the vlog because it's kind of late getting late it's almost nine o'clock so but I figured this will probably take me like an hour or less and I can knock it out and then carpet tomorrow and okay I'm tired <laughs> it is almost 11 o'clock I think I just finished painting the stair railings I did two coats of paint on that and it looks really good I'm gonna let it dry and then I'm gonna go tomorrow and paint a wall down there and then we can lay the carpet it's so exciting to get it done but it's actually only 10 38 but my kitchen's trashed the boys were in here playing pool and everything so i didn't come up here and do this but i'm gonna go ahead and do this now because i feel better about it than leaving that tonight By the way, this was really, really good. That filling is so good. I think I like it better with the pizza, I mean with the pie crust, but it was really good like this. And Marion didn't know I was making dinner, so he brought home pizza, so we had a lot of food. So we get, we'll have lots of leftovers. I won't have to cook tomorrow. You got a smile that makes the sun rise. See that you don't realize And that's what made me fall in love Cause you got the style The way your body makes my heart beat sound It's amazing all the time You are the only thing I need in life Oh, I want you Can't you see? I want you I believe Suddenly there you were with those bright blue eyes We were conversing into the night sky When you took my hand said let's leave now Don't wanna be shy I will let my guard down Don't wanna be shy I'm gonna say goodnight for now. Thank you guys for hanging out with us today coming along all the all the things we did it seems like the longest day I don't know why it seems like such a long day and I didn't even start blogging until this afternoon but it's been a busy afternoon my morning was nice and quiet which is usually the way it is but yeah the afternoon things get crazy so anyways make sure to give this video a thumbs up it really does help me out 
and click that subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed i would love to have you stick around be part of my youtube family as we like to say <laughs> i love you guys i will see you in my next video bye took my hand said let's leave now don't wanna be shy